Hi, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 27th, okay? So the timing is fluid. Keep that in mind. Not every reading is for you. Um, I'm sorry I didn't get more of the weeklies done yet. I was planning on it, but I had a... I had a washing machine problem today. <laughs> Blew a gasket or something. Anyway, um, I don't know. There's some sort of clog. And it caused a big hoorah. So I do apologize. <laughs> Hopefully I can get some done tomorrow. But they're coming back tomorrow. So anyhow, the rest of the week these will be done before the end of the day on Sunday. Um, I don't know what kind of day it's been for you, but I've had a bunch of nails pop off. It's just been one of those weird days. Anyhow, um, it's been an interesting day, I must say. But what do we have for a message today? Tower. Tower reversed. And the tower reversed is somebody has avoided something up until now, but I don't think they can avoid it anymore. This may be a shock. It may be a shock. It probably is. There could be a shock or, a, you know, a shock to your system or something like that. Now, the tower reversed could be a permanent loss, something, or it could be an extreme change. Something is changing very, very fast. Somebody could be building a new foundation, you know, because this could be the beginning. Maybe the tower has already fallen. Somebody is rebuilding. They're starting to build a new foundation new foundation is being built or this is a you know a necessary change that is needed that has been avoided up until now this is something you never saw coming that is happening you never 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 saw it coming so death interesting death endings lead to new beginnings so yeah, this is definitely a time of change. A big, big, big change. Universal change. The beginning of a new life by the looks of things because death is endings that lead to new beginnings. So something has obviously ended in the past. It's time to build a new foundation someplace else, right? What is this tower card in reversed? This is very sudden change, a sudden ending as well. So there could be a sudden ending that comes out of nowhere. I'm just being honest. Ace of Pentacles. Now the Ace of Pentacles is a new opportunity that has potential. This is a potential for long-term stability so there's potential for long-term stability here somebody has manifested something i mean the ace of pentacles is a golden opportunity for stability and security it's something you can take to the bank this is a huge opportunity go down a new path so somebody is getting an offer this is a gift this is a gift it is. Somebody is receiving a gift. They're receiving something of value after there's been an ending, after there's been a tower moment, or there's been some sort of extreme change or an ending. Now we have a new beginning because that Ace of Pentacles is a new beginning. It's a, it's a wonderful new beginning, right? It's a new solid opportunity that can lead to a lot of abundance. This is something you can touch. Something, you know, something that you can touch. This is something tangible. Somebody is receiving something that is real. It's really something you can hold on to. It's a gift from above, put it that way. Everything happens for a reason. Something, some, some sort of false sense of security or false foundation crumbled for a reason. Or it's crumbling right now for a reason. Mmm. Sun card reversed. Now the sun card reversed is not happy. I wonder if we have somebody here that has some health problems that need to be dealt with because the tower reversed can be extreme health problems and this could be health problems. So I don't know who needs to hear that message, but I feel like we have somebody here that needs to focus on their health. They may be ignoring something within themselves that they need to focus on. 
You have an opportunity right now, but you're going to have to focus. You've got to be ready to change. Be willing to make a change. I'm not sure what is going on here. Now, this is, this is something not growing. There's a lack of growth here or... Um, No, oh, that's a false impression of some sort. That's a false impression as well. There's some sort of darkness here. Somebody needs to heal. They need to heal. They need to take an opportunity to heal right now. This is an opportunity to heal. But there's a lack of healing. There's a lack of happiness. There's a lack of good health. There's a lack of positive thinking. But there's an opportunity for stability here. Somebody really needs to take the opportunity. Take it. Whatever the opportunity is, take it. They're going to be given an opportunity to heal from something, you know. Um, hermit reversed. Ace of Cups reversed. Moon reversed. We'll take a look at that. A lot of majors here. So the universe is driving a change. Okay, the universe is in charge right here. Somebody's about to get a reality check. This is a reality check, and this is a reality check. Things are about to get real, real fast by the looks of things. It's going to happen really. Things are changing really, really, really fast. Um, it's time to connect. It's time to reconnect. It's time to come out of hiding with the hermit reversed. So somebody may be needing to, maybe they're giving up their independence. I don't know. Anyhow, the hermit reversed is coming out, coming out of the cave, uh, reconnecting, socializing. Um, there's definitely a lack of happiness. Somebody has probably been alone. They're not happy anymore. They don't want to be alone anymore. There's definitely another opportunity here. There is, because endings lead to new beginnings. Everything happens for a reason. There's a reason why that old foundation crumbled, because it wasn't stable. It wasn't solid. You do have another opportunity here that can lead to a lot of abundance, but you're going to have to think positive. You're going to have to open up, you know, and come out of hiding and stop isolating yourself and open your heart. So somebody may need to open their heart because the Ace of Cups reversed and the, and the Sun card reversed. The, the Ace of Cups is about love and so is the Sun. Somebody may have closed off their heart. You know, they may have hidden their heart or something like that because the hermit is in reverse, is re next to it in reverse. That's hidden. Open your heart. Okay. All is not as it seems. You may have trust issues. Somebody may have trust issues or inner child problems that go all the way back to their childhood that cause them not to trust, to not have faith. I do believe that there is an opportunity here that should be taken. Okay. Um, there could be a lot of emotions here as well with the Ace of Cups reverse. There could be, I feel like there's some sadness. There is some sort of sadness, um, as there's a need to accept some sort of truth with the sun. I mean, the moon card reverse, this is coming out of darkness. Somebody has been in a period of darkness, but it's time to see the light. Okay. We have see the light in both of these cards in reverse, okay? It's, this is seeing the light. It's time to, you know, think positive. Think it. Think on the bright side. Remove the shadow. Remove the fear. And fear has been an issue, okay? So it's time to remove the fear. So anyway, I, th I feel like with the moon card reverse, there's some sort of, you can't hide. Both of these cards, you cannot hide. You, some, you can't hide from this. It's time to come out of hiding, okay? It's time to release the fear. So there's no trust here. We have somebody here. Maybe this goes, like I said, goes all the way back to childhood. Maybe there's been an absent mother. Um, I'm sorry, I gotta just take care of that. Anyhow, there's been some sort of, you know, lack of nurturing or lack of growth and there's no trust that's caused somebody not to trust. There's, there's uh, a need to uh, think positive and really, Open your heart. Something about heart. There's something about heart here. Um, this is some sort of shock. Something is happening. It comes out of nowhere. It's not something that you can hide from or you can run from. This is an opportunity that you asked for. You asked for this. So whatever it is, you asked for this. 
um, emotion, drowning in emotions with that Ace of Cups reverse. Somebody may be drowning in their emotions. This could be in a very emotional change, emotional ending, or emotional new beginning. Okay, whatever is happening, there somebody is is. Uh, being guided okay there's light here they're being guided they're being guided down a new path this is guided there's light there's light 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 okay and there's the path somebody is being guided down a new path the you know they are and i think that you know you need to go down that path even though if there's fear let go of the fear let go of the fear let go of the fear could be dealing with a Virgo, could be dealing with a Pisces, could be dealing with a Cancer, could be dealing with a Leo, could be dealing with a Scorpio. Um, we also have Aquarius here. Um, this is this is extreme. It happens all of a sudden. So whatever this is, this is very, very sudden. A sudden opportunity is being presented to somebody after, you know, there's been a significant ending or event. Ooh, six of wands reversed. Now, the six of wands reversed is lack of progress, lack of victory, battling, fighting. We have somebody here that is fighting their emotions. Take a look at that. That's emotions. Um, the six of wands reversed. That is uh, lack of confidence. Somebody needs to have confidence. And right now, they're lacking confidence, maybe even, maybe even lacking confidence in themselves. Um... Taking a new opportunity. Somebody has a new opportunity that they may have missed or they may have ignored or they weren't looking for it. They didn't want it and now they're going to be taking it. Take the new opportunity. There's, it's time to stop focusing on the loss. It's time to stop focusing on the, the third party or whatever it is. It's time to stop focusing on the relationship that didn't work out or whatever it is with that three of cups could be a friendship i don't know the three of cups reversed there's another opportunity that somebody has been reluctant to take that i think is going to be accepted or it's going to be right there and i think that now there's interest in it you know now I, I, there's interest wherever whatever it is that they have been focused on in the past that has made them so unhappy there's no progress being made there it's, it's time to wake up. This is an awakening. It's time to come out of hiding. It's time to socialize. It's time to connect. It's time to release your fears. It's time to accept the truth. It's time to, you know, go down that new path. So there is definitely a new path that is being presented to somebody. And this is an opportunity that leads to stability and security and abundance and love. Because the Four of Cups reverse is an offer of love and it's being accepted. You know, seeing it, seeing that this is an opportunity for emotional fulfillment. Whereas before it wasn't wanted or it wasn't desired or it wasn't, you know, interesting or something like that. Somebody wasn't wanting the, any type of love for some reason. Now they do. And I feel like it's, it's going to be, a, it's going to be emotional, <laughs> very extremely emotional. This is an extremely emotional situation um but there's a lack of confidence because of the false sense of security that somebody built up in the past so we we could have you know we do have somebody here that is fearful they are fearful of building up another false foundation so think there could be a setback there could be a delay in this foundation being built because of fear But this is seizing a new opportunity. It's time to look forward now. So I do believe that we have somebody here that is going to be uh, socializing. They're going to be opening up. They're looking for love, whereas they weren't before. Mm, five of Wands. Uh, five of Wands is... Some sort of game. This is playing games. <laughs> this is games, competition. There's a strong competition here. There is some sort of comp competition going on. Somebody is struggling. 
they are struggling. They are struggling with some sort, it could be inner conflict. This could be inner conflict. Somebody may be feeling very conflicted about, you know, fear of, because this is fear, and this one is too. But this is release the fear of getting played. Somebody's may be very fearful of getting played, you know. Anyhow, we do have a new beginning here that comes after a major disruption. And there is a major disruption that has caused something to end that was not real, okay? It wasn't, it was false. It ended for a reason. This is the opportunity that you asked for. Take it. Hey, man. So this is uh, wasting time, sacrificing, trying to prove a point. We have somebody here that needs to find their ability to look at things from a new perspective. They need to find their ability to look at things from a new perspective, and they're struggling to do so. And it's their own mind. If they're playing mind games with themselves. This is somebody that is playing mind games with themselves. There is an opportunity for abundance and stability here. There is. Somebody is receiving what they asked for. And what they've been doing is holding on to something. They've been holding on to something that isn't making any progress, that isn't reciprocating in love, that is based on false pretenses. They've been holding on to it because of illusion. But now there's some sort of competition going on as well. So we have somebody here that is probably losing a battle. This is losing a battle. Okay, it is. This is losing a battle. Somebody is losing a battle. They're, they're going to be taken out of the competition because they're struggling to let go. They're struggling to let go of something that is emotionally unfulfilling with that three of cups reversed. So they're going to be losing something of value. Anyway, I do feel, look at this on the bottom, ten of wands. This is making a conscious change to let go. Somebody is going to be letting go of something. They are. They're dropping. They're dropping some dead weight or they're dropping something that they have been carrying, that they have been holding on to, and they are, they are definitely going in a new... They're just giving it up. It's like, I give up. I give up. So I feel like on this day, there's definitely going to be a major change with these two cards. This is a major life change. It is. It is. So this is a, a huge moment where life changes, everything changes. Somebody's going to be taking an opportunity to go down a new path. They haven't been happy, there's been no growth where they've been. They've struggled long enough holding on. And I feel like this person has already lost something. But that four of cups reversed. They may have missed an opportunity. They may have missed an opportunity and waiting for progress to be made in another direction. Anyway, there's competition here as well. So for some of you, the competition is fierce. The comp and that's the truth. That is the truth. So I do believe that we have somebody here that is taking a new opportunity uh, that has been ignored or not wanted. The choice is being made. We have a very stubborn individual that has been fighting their emotions, stubborn, fighting emotions, fighting their feelings. Not making any progress. This is somebody that is unwilling to budge. This is somebody that is cocky and smug and controlling. 
you know, that has some sort of point to prove this person is about to lose something of value to the competition. Good luck. <laughs>